the world is an amazing place and I think we all need to, to learn that again because I think we take it for granted. But if I just continue to sit and do what I've always done, it won't change. I wanted to go do something that I never thought I would do and at the same time really be able to help people and the planet. I've been to the front line of the planet being destroyed. I feel more real. I'm so glad that I quit my job and I took that leap of faith. It is also very important never to lose sight of the bigger picture. It's the beginning of a new movement. It's the beginning of a new generation of eco-warriors. Um, from around the world, rising up to the challenge of making a positive difference for this planet. We need to start thinking for ourselves because we are the future and we can't be relying on past generations to always be making decisions for us. We are the new generations. When they're gone, then what are we going to do? We have to learn to take charge. We have to learn to put our foot down and be confident in the decisions we make. There was just nothing that could stop us and every single roadblock or obstacle was just minuscule to what we knew we were doing. Because it is the right thing to do and it feels true and it feels like we're getting through. You know, it doesn't mean I have a naive feeling that it's all gonna be all right and we're gonna save the forest in the next few years, but I can see it heading in that direction and I just wanna put my energy into being a part of that. But you can't be resilient until something has knocked you down. And that is what this project did. In some ways, I'm really proud of how we stuck together and 100 days later, the team is stronger than ever. We just kept pulling ourselves and each other up on hard days and that's amazing. People need to watch this movie. They need to see what we've seen, just to get a taste of it. When I sit in a place of, of peace and, and silence, I feel it underlying everything is a sense of hope for the future. So fundamental to, to what I'm going to do in the future and who I am now. By stepping out, by taking actions, that is how we're going to change the planet. I've educated over 2,000 students on having a passion for the forest and having a respect for our environment and these young adults will actually be running this country one day. Maybe it's a drop, but as we know, drops create ripples. We can get the feeling that it's huge. With the knowledge that I have right now and the experience that I've had in Borneo for 100 days, I could pass that on to everyone else that I meet along the way. Being the change that you want to see in the world is not easy. <laughs> and it's so rewarding and so worth it. But you have to be prepared to pick yourself up off the ground a hundred times. We will change. I think our generation has a mind to change. Take that leap of faith and be prepared for a rocky road, but it'll be the, the most beautiful road that you've ever been on to. The world is an amazing place, and I think we all need to, to learn that again.